Welcome, this is lesson 11, dialogue 1 of Japanese for Everyone. As you can see, it's a very short dialogue. <clears throat> so, um, but you should have a look at these funny little things here if you have not encountered them before. Um, those are Japanese quotation marks here, there, there, and there. So, this is how you, how you start the quotation, this is how you end it. Okay, apart from that, there are not many difficulties in here. There are a lot of names, so those are not words that you really have to remember. Okay, well, I'll just start reading it. Okay. Moshi moshi, hi. Abe san yo ei yo ikka desu. Yamakawa ei, sorry, uh, Yamakawa boeki no tsuki no to moshimasu ga. Right, very short, isn't it? Okay, Moshi Moshi. That's what you say um, when you answer the telephone, or that's generally hello when you say it on the telephone. So, hello, hi. Yes, or also hello. Abe, it's a name. Sangyo means industry. Oh, why do they have to start with that when I start with my videos? No, okay. <clears throat> I'm sorry about that. Okay, Abe Sangyo, Abe Industries. Eigyo, that's the. Um, Eigyo means, means business or operation. And ka is the section. You might know ka from uh, uh, in the meaning of lesson, for example, uh, the first lesson, daika, the second, uh, dainika, uh, daisanka, the third, the third lesson, and so on. And uh, this is the eleventh lesson, right? So this would be daijuika. But more generally, or in this case, it means section. And the ichi before ka always becomes ik. So, ikka is the first section, des, I am. So, hello, um, or this is, hello, this, this is Abe Industries, the first uh, operation section. Yamakawa Boeki. Yamakawa is another name. Boeki means trade, no, of Yamakawa trade, or Yamakawa trading. Company. Tsukino is the name, a Japanese surname. To, quotation mark. Moshimas, that's from Mosu. That's a humble way of saying you, to say or to be called. Ga, but. Kacho, and we have the ka here again. Section, cho, manager. No, I'm not going to explain this no here, just, just take it as it is. Kacho no Kitamura, another surname, San, Mr. You see, we have no San uh, after Tsukino because he's introducing himself, he's talking about himself. Then you never use San, Mr. It's always for other people. Uh, Kitamura, Mr. Kitamura, Irashaimas. <clears throat> we had Irashaimas in one of the last videos. Uh, where it was the polite form of kimas to come, but here it's the polite form of imas to be at some place. Ka question. So, I am uh, Tsukino, or well, maybe in English we would say I'm Mr. Tsukino, but we just say Tsukino without sun here. I'm Tsukino of Yamada Trading Company. Um, I'm called. I'm called Skino of Yamada Trading Company. Um, and is Mr. Kitamura, the section manager, Kitamura, is he there? Ka, the question. Hi. Yes. Or, yes, sir. Well, I understand. Skino. That's... Uh, 
the name, or that's what he thinks his name is, Skino, son, Mr. Des, you are, name, aren't you? Um, uh, yes, you're, you're Mr. Skino, right? The name was Skino, right? Ie, no, Skino, this it is, or I am. No, the name is Skino, not Skino. Huh? I beg your pardon? Osori Dimas. You already had that. Um, also had that already. Um, meaning I'm I'm terribly sorry. Osori Dimas ga but moichido one more time. Onegai shimas. Would you be so kind or please? So what did you say? I I'm sorry, could you please repeat it? Skino, so he repeats his name. Tachitsute to no off the row tachitsute to the tsu des it is. So it's the tsu of tachitsute to no. That's uh, one way <coughs> how you can spell things in, in in Japanese. Sorry, I have to take a sip of my coffee here. Okay. Now you know, you, you have those rows, a, i, u, e, o, kaki, ku, ke, ko, and so on, and then you have the, the sa, shi, su, se, so, and then the um, ta, chi, su, te, to, and he says, my name is pronounced Tsukino with the S of Tachi Tsute To, not with the S as he assumed of Sashi Su Se So. Now these are <coughs> easy to confuse, at least for, for me they are, uh, when you hear that, and um, especially when they are followed by a syllable that starts with a K, like here with the key. Tsuki and Tsuki sometimes hard to differentiate, for me at least, and, and for this guy on the telephone, or Mr. Webb, it's the same thing. It sounds the S and the Z. And you know, if, if you add those uh, two little dots, they both become Z, which is kind of, a, kind of the, the same sound, actually. Um, so they, they are kind of similar. Although this one, of course, is an affricate, and this one is a fricative. All right, um, well, that's, that's actually it for the dialogue. That was not so hard. Okay, let's continue with the next one. Bye-bye.